Smith, the read to Sabia. Oh, well, they go to the short side. Sabia, unstoppable. And it goes to Sabia. See you later. Ball hacked away, scooped up by Carter. Switch of play, Whitelock. All that's probing inside the 22. Ben Smith quickly on to Conrad Smith. The read to Sabia. Try it is. Julian Sabia has his third try of the tournament and straight away the All Blacks regain the lead. They are good clever players. Three or four men drawn in, heated up on the inside. That little inside pass of Conrad Smith, I think it was, caught for it quickly down the blind side. Realised four on two, the strength of Sabia still had a fair bit to do. He's big, strong and powerful and no match for the last defender. Boshed out the way, in the corner he goes. Here's Romano with a big charge. Runs straight into Ankles. Finds him hard to stop. Now busting onto it is Sabia. And the referee will take a look here. Sabia believes he scored. George, please try yes or no. Roman, try yes or no. I'll come back to you. Well, initially looked short, but there's the ball on the line. Never in doubt. <laughs> Julian Sabia going over in a couple of tacklers. Once again appearing right in the middle of the field. And just too big, too strong for Namibia to handle. Tales moves it on, spinning, trying to get on the outside of Dane Coles. Drops it off to Nakai Tarthi. Coles is there, makes the tackle, rips the ball away. Carter, Sabia, Julian Sabia is in for a hat trick. again, France going nowhere on attack, they make a mistake and Sabia punishes them with his third try of the game. Two on one from Carter to Sabia, and they just make it look so easy. Lines Vito at the line out, Kane has it in the back and I think the All Blacks might just try and shove this over from a driving mall here. Kane has it in the back. Well they go to the short side, Sabia! Unstoppable and 50 up for the All Blacks. Oh, hang on, hold, it, hold all tickets. <laughs> I can answer that. It's a try. What is wrong with that? Well, if his momentum has stopped, he's only allowed to place the ball, but he looked like he had forward mm. momentum. He's got so much power. Good decision, one-on-one, -on -one. try. There is no reason why you shouldn't award the try. That's 30 seconds of our lives, we'll never get back. <laughs> <laughs> wow. New Zealand waited enough time for that try. And here he's hovering behind the, the, the mall as he's done, behind the ruck sand scrub, just being in the right place at the right time. Quick call to Kirbalo and over. Franks. Oh, hands were on. You could hear the call from Sabaya. Now some room for Carter to defend. Oh, brilliant ball to Sabaya! This is magnificent from the All Blacks. And they're in for their third try. Oh, they butchered it, but they didn't even need it. Just one more phase and brilliant offload from Carter. And as we see here, Franks could have given the ball there, Sabea, it was a four on two, but the brilliance of Carter, the dummy defend and the reverse flick to Sabea, nobody's catching him, Arrow and Spedding give up, beautiful show and go, Pape no chance, offloaded, one arm, reverse flick, off his weak, weak arm, and Sabea thankful doesn't even need to beat anyone. That is mesmeric. Puts it high, Ben Smith with the chase. And he's got it, Ben Smith. Spinning's gone down in a heat. Brilliant take, and now the French are in all sorts of trouble. Metallic, and it goes to Sabia. See you later. Oh, my goodness me. New Zealand with all the space and 
time. And then Aaron Smith is just picking off. Defenders running backwards. And he still had work to do, but my goodness me, he made it look easy. Bumping off two world-class defenders. Spedding is no slouch in defence. Saber just showing what class of power he has.